Say good afternoon. We're so glad you're here. We daily vlog. So if you enjoy today's video, make sure you come back every day. Kids are still in their jammies because it's that kind of day. I am not. Um, I'm working. Though I think it's like just before one o'clock. I think my day is kind of winding down, which is great because I had a very busy work week and even a very busy Friday. You want me to read this book? This is... It's a small world. Oh, thank you. This is sweet. Okay, let's read It's a small world. Hello, world. Lunch feast. I put the leftover bruschetta and our avocado toast. Yeah. So delish. <laughs> What's so funny over there? This kid is absolutely not gonna sleep. He's literally looking at every single thing in the world that we walk past. But that's also cute. A few moments later. Success. I don't think we said that James did fall asleep. So both kids are napping right now. And I got this Mountain Dew. I loved their pitch black. We both did. Mountain Dew pitch black. It was like our family's Halloween like festive drink and I think the last time we found that was like 2019. Um, they're always coming out with new voodoo mystery flavor things now and this has like pumpkins on it and so like we were thinking like this could be maybe this, not that it would taste like pitch black, but it would be like something good to have for Halloween, but it's zero sugar. And I know sugar is not good for you, but I really prefer sugar, sugar, sugar over sugar replacements um, in my beverages, just like as a taste preference. And we were gonna buy a case of it. And I'm so happy we didn't <laughs> because even though it's yummy, like for like a little Friday drink, um, just not just not my jam. If if anyone has seen Pitch Black, I I think we've even looked on their like website as far as like their production goes. I don't even think it's there anymore. Um, this is yummy, but the the cases were like seven bucks, and this was far less to give it a try first. This is just becoming a pop taste testing channel now. I'll take a drink of it and tell you wow, what I, what flavors I think it is. It's definitely like orangey, citrusy something. But again, I just can't like, the fake sugar is not, it like just lingers on your tongue. That's the best way to describe it. Yeah, it's like citrusy. Peter, you taste it. Yeah. Melting. Yeah, you thought that about the Dream World too, mm -hmm. the Coke. Maybe it's just like what getting old is. Like just just <laughs> driving cops is melted. <laughs> melted celebrities. What's up, Peloton? I'm right. Thank you for joining me. For opting into a Peloton ride today instead of a four mile run. Just mixing it up on the shorter runs. Check it out. We got pumpkin candle, trick or treat. Got a Goose Island Oktoberfest beer in my new Yeti insulator. I have to do send a couple emails for work. We got Gilmore Girls Fall on while the kids are still napping. Sarah's finishing the vlog. It's the weekend, everybody. Tell her to wipe her tuchus with some wipes. Look who's awake. Is he awake? <laughs> I don't know. 
<laughs> he's awake. Okay, now he's asleep. This has never happened before in our lives. All right, we've left the house for the evening. Sarah's rocking her new sweater. Love it, love it. Um, a little chilly out, but we're going to Whole Foods for some, hoping that there's some vegan pizza so we can grab a slice or two for dinner. Then we're gonna walk like south. Pre-dinner. Pre -dinner, yeah. Because we're gonna have leftover pasta. Yes, and then we're gonna run. Run. We're gonna walk south to, uh, was it a TJ Maxx? And Trader Joe's. And Trader Joe's for some other fun festivities. Oh, look at these runners. I had to switch the camera around to Peter because he's in his favorite kind of outfit. Shorts and a sweatshirt. Sweatshirts and a short. Why do I, it's, it's shorts and a sweatshirt sounds so much better. Yeah. And sweatshirts and shorts. <laughs> that is the face of a kid who loves food. <laughs> mm -hmm. Who just got himself. What'd you get, the buffalo? We went for vegan pizza and there was a spot for the- Tell everybody in the comments, Sarah, we tried. We did. We did. We really did. I also asked I if we should get- a little tiny pizza. I also asked if we should get utensils and Sarah said, do we eat pizza with utensils? And the answer is no, but like we also have a one-year-old that eats pizza. Ooh, Teddy wants in on it. So we're gonna stop. It's also almost nighttime now. Ooh, do the pizza dance. Hey, hey, do the pizza dance. Hey, hey. <laughs> Delicious, but no dance. <laughs> Here's my cheese. Here's my teddy bear. <laughs> I can't wait till you can start eating normal food, Teddy. It's gonna be a whole different world. Sarah's, Sarah's trying to get Teddy to chill for a second because he's getting a little antsy. We have the carrier if he wants to go in that, but I figured. Do you want that cookie? It's time to show James the pumpkin cookie. You'll love it, I swear. You just take a bite of it. He's unsure about the sprinkles. He has like picked M&Ms off of other things before. Yeah. So what if he sat there and just picked all the sprinkles off? Do you see this bite? <laughs> Do you see the bite that he took? Are you kidding me? Was it delicious? He likes it. Oh yeah. Can we put it in the tray? We're in the rough and tough streets of Chicago. I don't want you to lose it. Next to it. Which, which is which? They're both, uh, we got our own. They're like vegan jelly filled ones. Check out for Sarah because I'm not a big fan of the jellyfish ones. Say, why is he do this for you? All right, are we happier? Yes. Wow, him's cute. Is he a big kid? He's the biggest kid. <laughs> <laughs> I accidentally took a video, so I got that. <laughs> you know, just walking down Clark, going shopping, Friday night. Oh, here's Four Corners. We've wanted to go in here for so long. Four sided. Four sided. <laughs> But every time we come by, it just doesn't work out. This, oh, so sleepy. It was a fun Friday night, just walking through the city. We're coming up on the movie theater that we saw. Which Marvel did we see? Scarlet Witch. And we're also coming up on the corner where there's a stands, one of the first stands we ever went to. And the, oh, what's the hotel called? Hotel Versi that we stayed at uh, about a year and a half ago, just for like the fun little one night staycation with Jamesy before we had like a, a, a day of events in the city. <sighs> Where are my friends coming up behind me? We have made it to TJ Maxx. We are on the hunt for some Moscow Mule glasses with jack-o'-lantern faces on them. Hmm. Where are they? It's like just the right amount of cheese, right? Yeah, it's cheesy, but just the right amount. Mm. But like the silhouettes, you like it, Teddy? Teddy likes it, Teddy approves. It's like $12.99. Well, we're getting it. Right? Toss it in the bassinet. It's cute, right? It's going out tonight. It's cute, right? Yeah. yeah. Plus, we got new neighbors, and we think there might be little kids there, so we're trying to schmooze them. The key is when to know 
is the right and not right time to let James out to burn some energy. Inside Trader Joe's, the right time. <laughs> I don't know if James wants the haunted house, cookie kit, or the JoJo's. Either way, I'm on board. We got some goods, reasonable, and Jamesy got Trader Joe's pumpkin stickers. Success? Yes. Crisp air, crisp city air in the fall. Wow. <laughs> Sarah feels alive. Do you need an apple spice from Starbucks in the corner after the walk home? I really don't. To share I, it with me? I haven't. I like to want sweet right now. Oh. I want water. I got you a water. Thank you. You got this. You got to take them off. Put them on your cheeks. Trying to tire James out again before we get all the way home. What a beautiful night. Oh. oh there's like fungus. Ooh. Run, 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 run. Run. That is so cool. Uh, 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 uh. All the different letters. Peekaboo! <laughs> Who's getting more tired? Mommy or Jamesy? Okay, 24 hours makes a big difference. You did it. Almost. Yep. 24 hours later, he knows where they go. We've been practicing with four. This causes less often frustration. And we've mastered these, so now we can add in the others. Good job, Jamesy. Okay, I'm getting on the Peloton at 10.45 at night, so I'm very proud of myself. Um, Teddy has been down and Jamesy, Peter's in there with Jamesy. I'm just not gonna, I'm not gonna jinx what I think is going on. Um, but yeah, hopefully I'll check in soon with good news. Good news there. Everything had to be pushed back today because he woke up at 9 a.m. after like playing some sleep catch up. Um, and then his later nap, and then he came out on the couch and fell asleep for longer. So it's definitely longer, I'm sorry, it's definitely later than I had hoped for. But we also just didn't want to push it with how the day went. We're, we're doing our best. We're just, we're just doing our best following the cues and all that good stuff. So. And we are just gonna go for a 30 minute pop ride with Cody Rigsby. 30 minute pop ride. Today's playlist is all about girl power. Okay, I'll say it again. Girl power. It's the next day. We forgot to sign off. Um, what I didn't want to jinx last night was that James seemed in better spirits, wasn't fighting it as much. It was still late, but it wasn't as much of a fight. And sorry, I thought he was gonna get my chips and salsa. Um, but yeah, it was just better. Teddy, on the other hand, still struggled all night. So we are tired, but we're excited for our Saturday. We're going to go to the zoo. It is good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>